Today I want to talk about photographing with intention and what that means and why you should be doing it. Uh, but first, if you're liking this direct to the point content, please like, subscribe, click the bell icon. It helps me out quite a bit. So shooting with intention. So first of all, I need to say that there's been countless times in which I was a guest at an event and I would just observe the photographer working it and they would just do a thing where they would pace a few steps, take a picture, pace a few more steps, take a picture. And that's really like not what they should be doing if I'm honest. They should be trying to capture meaningful images. And there should be intention behind every time you press the shutter. You should be able to say what you're photographing. So in other words, like I'm photographing that guy's reaction to that guy, <laughs> you know, simple. But some people aren't even doing that. They're just like, oh, there's two people talking. I'll take a picture. They snap and then they look at it as if there's a mystery behind what's going to be on the back of the screen. When you're shooting with intention and every meaning, any, every image you make is meaningful, you're going to know if you got the shot or not for the most part. When you're looking at the back of the screen, it's confirmation. It's not like, oh, what, what photo did I just take? Let's take a look, you know? Um, when you're shooting with intention, you, you're, it it's, it's goes beyond just am I capturing meaningful images. It means like, am I being an efficient photographer? So for me, it's like, I know the shots I need to get. I need to get different vantage points, each corner of the room perhaps. I need a shot to show the scale of the crowd. I need a shot to do blah, 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 blah. And that's what I'm trying to do. Um, and if you don't really know what the job requires and you probably aren't really you know, far along on your career, um, it's okay if you're just starting out, but eventually like, you should know exactly what you're doing. And every job should basically be like muscle memory at that point. And when you're like muscle memory, able to just capture everything you know you need to capture, then you can start looking for the surprising moments. You can start just being present and then grabbing shots of what's actually happening in front of you and not just imposing your shot types onto what's happening.